there, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Daniel Rosal here. Um, I just received a microphone in the post from AliExpress. So I wanted to do a quick comparison so that you can hear the difference between a few different microphones. The microphone that you're currently listening to now, be aware that I'm, um, I have a cold currently, so my voice is a little huskier than usual. Um, I'm in a park in Jerusalem and you can actually hear in the background, I'm gonna stop talking for a few seconds. You can kind of hear the sound of chirping birds, so I'm not sure if that's going to pick up. Um, the microphone, this is the Boya BYBL 6060. And this was a, this is the first um, XLR shotgun microphone with Phantom Power I've owned. Um, and I bought it after I purchased the uh, Canon XA40 Pro camcorder, because that has Phantom and that has XLR, so I can use these better microphones now. The problem is it's a little bit too big for the camcorder. It's a 28 centimeter microphone, it's only a 21 centimeter camcorder. So it's a little bit big, so... I'm planning to get the Audio Technica, um, one of their short shotgun mics, but in order to just test out that form factor, I picked up a cheap uh, short shotgun in AliExpress um, from Andour. So we're gonna swap over now to that microphone and uh, you guys can listen to the difference in sound quality. All right, so we've just swapped over now to the new microphone. As I said, this is like a $15 and doer short shock and microphone. Relative to the uh, Boya that you guys were just listening to, it's a much smaller microphone, so it will fit um, less in the camera bag. Now, just to say one more thing, because we're talking about sound here, um, both shots here, 48 volt, like the microphone, and they just have a regular foam on top. I'm not using a furry windshield or anything like that for wind protection. And just for the sake of comparison between camera mounted shotgun microphones and handheld interview mics, you're listening now to the Shure PGA48 connected directly over a wired XLR cable into the Canon XA40 Pro camcorder. So this is a wired XLR microphone you're listening to. This one actually doesn't require phantom power, but um, you seemingly can use it with phantom power without any ill effect because it's a decent uh, brand. So um, we're trying to replicate the shot. I'm about the same distance from the camera operator as I was before. And um, this microphone has a little bit more handling noise than some of the other Shure microphones, but for $50, I think it's a really solid investment. Gonna give you guys a few seconds of ambient noise pickup using the reporter's mic like this, just holding it. Up in the air, and uh, that is the comparison between these three microphones. If you wanna get more videos from me, please subscribe to the YouTube channel.